Hello. I'm Sean. I'm a sophomore at Wahoo High School. And this is the poem I've entitled Passion. Passion. Passion is the flame that drives humanity, for better or for worse. Passion drives the inventor, whose ideas won't be limited by what is currently known. Passion drives the soldier who needs to make it back home. Passion drives the writer who creates an entire world inside their mind. Passion is what drove the Wright brothers, who knew that flight was possible. Passion drives revolutionaries who will not be content with the way things are. Passion is not without darkness, however. After all, passion drove Germany in World War II, who believed that the war could lead them to a brighter future. Passion drove Americans west, where they took native lands and lives. Passion drove the Crusades, senseless violence for some land that two groups laid claim to. Yet, what is a human without passion? Without passion, people lose motivation. They stop going. They fall into a hole of depravity where only darkness lurks. A darkness that threatens to claim lives and minds with depression that can grip someone in the darkness and just won't let go, with violent tendency where passion does burn, but it burns in darkness, with anxiety where darkness obscures the paths to new passions and offers paths into more darkness. So what is passion? It isn't a benevolent force that brings only good. It isn't an evil weapon that brings only ruin. Passion's true nature is a tool, like any hammer, a tool that can be used to build or destroy. This, of course, is dependent on the user. Passion can be used to build oneself into the very skies and beyond. Passion can be used to tear things to bits. Passion can also be used to, to inspire, inspire passion in others, to bring, out, to bring others out of the darkness and give them a tool by which they can continue. That is the passion of a good therapist or, or a good friend who sits with you in your darkest hour. But what's the point? What's the point of pointing that out? I guess that point lies with each of you.